All right. Today we're taking a drive in our 1990 Toyota Hiace fire truck. This one we just picked up from the port. Um, this is my, my first drive with it. It seems to be a great truck so far. We'll just get out of this parking lot and get it out on the open road. Manual steering in this guy, so it's a little bit harder than the other high aces, but this one is a lower trim, so it's basically a gas engine, rear wheel drive. Um, these run a bit cheaper, which it's great if you're just looking for a simple work truck. This is, this is pretty hard to beat. It's the Toyota 2Y 1.8 liter gas engine. Which is actually an engine that was used in the US uh, for some models, so parts are pretty easy to come by. And yeah, this is about as simple as you can get for a truck. But it is a fire truck, so it has that fire service maintenance pedigree. Um, so yeah yearly inspections and a lot of other really nice um, additions that make it potentially more reliable for the long run and you know that it's been well maintained in the past this thing has been taken really good care of yeah so the gas engine trucks run really really well um, I haven't had any issues with them they seem to be on par with the reliability of the diesels, plus you get a little bit better acceleration, just slightly more power in general. And you get a nice big steering wheel so that you get some leverage over that manual steering. these trucks. Um, this one has only 12,400 kilometers on it, so super low mileage. Low mileage for any Toyota. Yeah, these things are great. Um, I have no complaints driving this one. Brakes feel good. Everything feels really good in these fire trucks. Usually when we bring these in, they don't need anything. All the maintenance is up to date from the fire service. There. Roundabout goes to show that the manual steering is fine. And these are surprisingly small trucks. They look like the larger size box trucks that we have in the US from the outside, but in reality, they're not much bigger than a full-size pickup truck, um, like a Ford F-150 or similar. They're about the same size, they're just a little bit more boxy and the cab over driving style. trucks do not come with AC but this one has heat that works great um, the original AM radio and a lot of the original fire truck equipment you've got the switches down there for the siren lights all that but really the biggest benefit with this one is the all original tailgates uh, so you have tailgates on every side and they haven't been messed with at all usually the fire trucks have a modified bed where it's not quite as usable for the standard work truck, but this one has all the original bed sides. You can convert it back to normal super easily. There's some stuff bolted into the bed that you can just take out. Um, yeah, this one is a great configuration. And it runs a lot cheaper than the four wheel drive diesels. Yeah, 
that's pretty much it for this fire truck. Pull back into the lot here. Super clean, really nice on the outside, and especially nice on the inside. This thing feels like it's been barely used. So, great configuration. We're gonna get it all cleaned up and ready to go pretty soon. You can find more updated pictures and videos and stuff on the website within the next week or so. So yeah, um, definitely check it out. Thank you for watching JDMCarMotorcycle.com.